Hi, I'm Gaurav, CEO and co-founder of Peersight. We recently closed a $7 million seed round to accelerate development of persistent ocean monitoring satellites. Let me start from the beginning. If you've ever seen or played strategy games like Age of Empires, you'd remember that visibility was limited to where you had buildings or units. Everything else was grayed out. It's called the fog of war, a lack of situational awareness. This is the reality for 70% of our planet, the oceans. No organization or country has persistent visibility of their own waters, let alone rest of the oceans. And just like in those games, the fog enables the bad actors to operate covertly without repercussions. For example, one in five fish is illegally caught, resulting in $24 billion of losses, pushing millions into forced labor and intensifying sea life extinction. It doesn't stop at your plate though, Unsolicited activities like dumping of chemical waste, drug and human trafficking, and terrorist infiltrations are all carried out by dark ships hiding under the fog. Inability to monitor and reroute traffic during the six-day Suez Canal blockage triggered a domino effect, leading to billions in losses. My co-founder Vineet and I have spent a decade at Indian space organizations building the technology required to solve these problems. Our observation was that existing solutions and competitors offered a high-resolution imagery, but only for areas of interest and upon request. At Peersight, we want to make situational awareness a default. To do so, we are building a constellation of backpack-sized satellites equipped with all-weather imaging eyes and ears, SAR and AIS sensors, serving as the primary layer of surveillance across all oceans 24-7. Because we are one-sixth the cost, this enables many more nations and corporates to always be monitoring the oceans proactively rather than reactively after an incident. We make money from our very first satellite. Our path to 180 million ARR includes revenue diversification across exclusive economic zone monitoring, ship liners, insurance firms, and hedge funds. We are a rapidly growing team of seven. Our first demonstration mission is scheduled to launch on ISRO's POEM platform in June next year, with the subsequent free-flying satellite mission set for end of 2024. These milestones will propel our technology readiness levels to 7 and 9 respectively. And while the oceans are a start, we see a number of terrestrial applications as future opportunities expanding our TAM. In strategy games, there was a cheat code that would reveal the whole map. Let us provide that cheat code for democratizing round-the-clock maritime surveillance. Thank you.